Hi, this is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. I'm going to show you how to create this hot looking sunburst and this cool looking starburst with just a few filters and adjustment layers. This document is 1000 by 1000 pixels with a resolution of 72 pixels per inch. Double click on your background layer. When this window appears, type in base and click OK. Make sure black is your foreground color and press Alt or Option plus Delete to fill this layer with black. Go to View and make sure rulers and snap are checked. Press Ctrl or Command plus T to call up your transform tool and then click on the ruler on the left and drag out a guideline to the center. It'll snap in place because we have snap checked. Go to the top ruler and drag out that guideline. Press Enter or Return to accept the transform. Call up your elliptical marquee tool. Go to the center of your guidelines and press Shift and Alt or Shift and Option and then click and drag out a circle. Go to Select, Modify and Feather. We'll feather it by 50 pixels. Call up your gradient tool and click on the gradient box and make sure radial gradient is highlighted. Click on the lower left box and click on the color box. Pick a light yellow and click OK. Click the lower right box and choose a bright red. Click below the color bar and another box will appear. Click the color box and pick an orange color. Click on the orange box and slide it to the center. Click OK. Go to the center and press Shift as you drag out a line to the right edge of the selection. Release and press Ctrl or Command plus D to delete the selection. Go to Filter, Stylize and Extrude. We'll choose Pyramids, 20 pixels, Depth 175 and Random. Go back to Filter, Distort and Wave. We'll choose 5 for the number of generators, the wavelength 32 to 33, the amplitude 1 to 2, the scale is 100%, the type is sine, and repeat edge pixels. Keep in mind, depending on the size and resolution of your image, you may want to use different numbers. Let's make the center of our sunburst unwavy. Click on the layer mask icon to make a layer mask for the wavy layer and click on the gradient box at the top. Click on the black to white gradient thumbnail and click OK. Click on the radial gradient icon. Click on the center, press shift and drag to the right. Press Ctrl or Command plus H to hide the guidelines. By making a radial gradient in the layer mask, we essentially masked the wavy center, thereby gradually revealing the straight layer underneath. Let's add more black to both sides. Go to Image and Canvas Size. We'll change the inches to percent and type in 175 for the width. Now click on the bottom layer to make it active and go to the new layer icon. Press Ctrl or Command as you click on it to make a new layer below the active layer. Press Alt or Option plus Delete to fill it with black. We're ready to make our cool blue starburst. Click off the eyeball to hide the wavy layer and click on the straight base layer to make it active. Click on the Adjustment Layer button and choose Hue Saturation. Go to Hue and slide it to change the hue to a cool color combination. Whether it's creating an icy starburst or a hot wavy sunburst, have fun experimenting with different shapes and color combinations. This is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. Thanks for watching.